just a quick video in India I'm sure you guys have been hearing this hijab debate and all this madness going on now rather than dealing with the crux of the issue which is that the right wing guys have suddenly lost the plot just to appease them the government is not allowing Muslim women with hijab to enter schools they're not allowing them to receive a basic human right but many Muslims are protesting the ban it violates the right to express religious belief and the right to an education without discrimination and this is the only reason just to appease their far-right vote base but rather than dealing with this issue head-on look what the newspapers are plopping out that's the, that's the best word frankly yeah oh hijab is uh, not obligatory according to this uh, random guy wait a minute who are you and then of course you got Anab Goswami which is like uh, Fox News of India now let me un uh, make out make out you know make a one point absolutely clear to you so think of him as the Tucker Carlson of India is the hijab an essential religious practice uh yes yes it is essential does not mean optional <laughs> ladies and gentlemen essential does not make it a matter of choice well according to indian law you can't walk around topless well for that matter you can't walk around bottomless completely and start swinging your genitals in people's faces nor can you randomly decide to cross a set of red lights why don't you make a case of choice there well because it's the law this man-made law that you guys have agreed upon is allegedly good for you and good for the society well in that same vein hijab is islamic law god has decided that it's good for us and for society if some hardline muslims say no no the hijab is absolutely necessary and obligatory for all muslim women to wear a muslim woman not wearing the hijab will be questioned for her religious beliefs well in that case the indians who say that you guys need to cover up your you know your bosoms they should be called uh, hardliners as well because they're also obligating that you have to cover up is you don't have a choice about it including the government officials including the police force all of these guys you've got to call them all hardliners no you're not going to do that well you obligate the covering of the private parts 